with Chinese player Li Na. Thank you for joining us, and I'm sure you're thrilled to go out there. And coming off an Olympics where your country hosted in Beijing, I'm sure you're going to get a huge <laughs> ovation from the crowd. Are you ready for that? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm, I was waiting for the match long time, so yeah, I'm ready for it tonight. How about playing against Elena? Last time you played against her was Sydney a year ago, and, and you beat her. What will you draw from that? Oh, you know, right now I play her nothing to lose, so we'll see. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Li Na of China. And she'll be taking the court in just a moment. And we are now looking for Elena Dementieva, who is the 2004 finalist here. And um, sometimes they take a little extra time. Sometimes there's a bathroom break. Sometimes there's a lost earring, as happened with uh, Serena the other night. Uh, sometimes... Michael, are you, the the of those, are you having another there one of those is. Doug Llewellyn moments? I, I, you know what, Al? I am. Thanks for that. <laughs> Russell the bailiff is waiting right down there. Here she is, the 2004 U.S. Open finalist, Elena Dementieva. How you, how you doing? You ready for tonight? Yeah, I'm really very excited about tonight. You're playing a match at night here on Arthur Ashe Stadium. How special is that? It is a very special moment for me. First time playing uh, in night session you know, during this week, so I'm very excited. Your gold medal summer continues. You have nine straight hard court wins. Are you playing as good as you ever have? Well, that was a very special moment, but it's a new challenge coming up, and um, I'm just looking forward to it. All right, good luck. Thank you. Elena Dementiva. Al, she'll sign some papers and then on out to the court. <laughs> See that uh, Armstrong and the grandstand still have got good representation as we get set and underway here with Lee Serving. Okay, we're going to kicking So Dementieva starting strongly, two breaks. I mean, I understand they don't want to build a facility for tests, but we've got the grandest one right there. I, I understand all that. But, so what's You're saying it's going to be a what, repeat what, a month later. A month later? What's the point? Well, I'm just sorry, I just don't get it. Good. Relish the Olympic experience. It's a wonderful thing. To carry the flag, the march and opening ceremonies. That's all. That tennis players never do. Following that one, Djokovic and Cilic here at Ash to follow. The name and Gonzalez match the winner. They're plays a coach for so long, and her mom wasn't a tennis player. Didn't play tennis. Okay, just watching this first set, Trace, more carefully, it's... The old slicer-roo. Oh, oh, a missed yeah. opportunity for oh, me now. It was a short ball. Dementieva does Demonstrate. survive the game, game. holds and takes the first set. In 2006, Zheng Zhi Yan Zi in here and took Kuznetsa but a 7 6 in the third. right after remember she quit for two years so now she's thinking hey i can choose her own tournaments that she wanted to play and that was big for her so it's one all Yeah, the imposing. 
losing her game if she gets tight. Down with Bob Rink after he won. Yeah, yeah, yeah. come apart for Lee. number one since she's been gone. So Elena Dementieva is in the quarters of the U.S. Open for the fifth time in her career. And three times she's gone further. She's been in the finals once, the semis twice. And you'd have to regard her as a favorite in her quarterfinal match, Tracy, would you think? Yes, without a <laughs> Much with Elena Dementieva. Congratulations now into your fifth quarter final at the US Open. You like it here? Yeah, I like it very much. And I'm um, just very excited. It feels like a first time. The difference between the first set when it was a little more close and then the second set where you really blew it away? Well, I think, you know, I was a little bit nervous in the beginning, you know, especially the last time we played, I lost to her. So it took me a couple of games before I started to feel better and, you know, just um, be more aggressive on the court. I mentioned your gold medal summer. You are on a 10-match hard court win streak now. You had the gold medal in Beijing. You talk about how special that was. Tell us a little bit more about that. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. It was a very special moment for me, you know, and for my family and for my country. And um, th this is something you will never forget in your life. I'm just a little bit sad that the happiest day in my life already passed me by. <laughs> well, how would that compare, though, to a championship here? Well, it's just an, another challenge for me. And, um, you know, I just feel very exciting being here. I try one more time. All right, Elena, congratulations. Elena Dementieva. There 